What is up everyone, Mr. Aviator here, bringing you another episode of The Sims 4 here on Aviator Games. You guys, last time we left off, I ended up quitting my job. Now you guys, I did not retire. I just quit my job for now. I know I'm a young adult, a lot of you guys were freaking out about that. We will be going back to work one day. I just want to spend some time with my family, write a few more books, and play a few more, or make a few more video games. And then we're going to go back to work, maybe not on the tech guru career, maybe we'll be an astronaut next. I'm a sim that kind of likes to do multiple different things. I like to tackle different careers and Cassandra had a girl's day out which went horribly it was one of the worst days ever actually her friend actually ended up running away from her at the end of her girl's day out and uh, you guys have been complaining about Julia's appearance so today I'm making it a point that we will be changing her looks because I uh, like the clothes she's wearing I'm not gonna lie they're disgusting they're ugly <laughs> but you guys before we hop into the episode make sure you slap that like button lemon heads let's go for 2,000 likes on this video if we get 2,000 likes I'll have another episode of the sims 4 out for you tomorrow and also i want to bring this up so i i mentioned that to make up for missing one day of sims i was going to do more videos this saturday and then some of you guys suggested doing something called super saturday you want me to do this every saturday and basically what super saturday is is a day where i upload four to five videos only on saturday so instead of getting your normal two videos a day on saturdays you'll get four to five you want me to call it super saturday now if you think that's a good idea and that's something you would really enjoy on saturdays make sure you tell me down below yes do super saturdays or no don't do Super Saturdays. Comment that down below. I'd really like to get your guys' opinion on that. Um, okay, so let's get started, you guys. Right now, I am still sleeping. I had a really, really late night last night, and I was just struggling with trying to finish this video game, and we didn't make a lot of money off it. It was depressing. Uh, so I pretty much vowed, never shall I again make a video game for a while, at least. Um, I still want to make one or two more before we go back to a real job, just to kind of get my creative juices flowing. And uh, I think right now, since only Cassandra's up, we should probably try to get that girl that sh that ran away from her on her girl's day out uh, to come over here and maybe chat with her because we had we were close to getting her to becoming friends with us, and and she needs seven friends. Where did she go? Is this? Oh, this was her. Oh yeah, they are not as close as I thought. Let's invite her to hang out over here, see if she's willing to come out. She's busy right now. Crap! I don't want her to be busy. We really need a friend. Now, Bella, what is this? Acquaintances and their mother. So let's invite Bella over. She can be friends with her mom. Now, this one should be easy. She shouldn't be uh, easily offended. Bella is busy right now. Okay, no one loves her. I get it. I get it. Okay, let's see. Is there anyone? There's Mortimer. Let's see if he's busy. We'll invite Mortimer. This is her dad. This should be an easy friend to make. You would think. Why is everyone busy right now? Presley. Presley, how about you? How about you invite, we'll invite you to um, maybe her, her and Presley. Now, she somewhat knows Presley. They went to school together, obviously. They're both teenagers at the same time. She'll invite Presley over to, uh, let's go to, uh, not the museum. I think the bar. The Rattlesnake Juice Lounge slash bar. We'll, we'll invite her there and kind of see how this girl's day goes. Hopefully, it doesn't end with Presley running down the sidewalk like a maniac trying to get away from Cassandra. I don't know what's so bad about her. I think she's pleasant. Obviously, um, Allison didn't last time. <laughs> okay, so here we go, coming to the bar. Now, this is where Cassandra's mom spends a lot of her time, at the bar. Bella is a bar hopper. But okay, so Presley's here. Let's go to Presley. Let's give her a heartfelt compliment. Let's brighten her day. We're feeling pretty good right now. Let's get to know Presley. Uh, share some creative ideas, because we're one of those musician-type people. Then get to know her again, then tell her a joke. And that should be good for now. We need seven friends, which is really hard because she only has three right now. So we need to make four more friends in order for her to get promoted. And right now we heavily rely on Cassandra's income because I don't have a job at the current moment. Which I'm not surprised. I mean, I'm kind of surprised actually that uh, a lot of you guys were angry about that. Uh, but I just want to stress it again. We're not retired forever. Just for now. We just want to spend... Oh, there's Bella. I thought you were busy, Bella. I thought you were busy. You're such a liar. I don't like it. <laughs> okay, so we learned she's a geek. We'll discuss her interests. Um, we will maybe goof around a little bit. Now, since she's a geek, she should like um, discussing like video games and stuff. Um, let's go to uh, tell a funny story. Now, where's the video game stuff? Deep, oh, discuss the latest games. And then we can even... Uh, what do I want to do? Joke about politicians. That sounds fun. And now, see, we're earning a friendship with Presley pretty easily. This this is a no-stress situation. We should be friends with her before the end of the day, 
Uh, like no question about it. My baby before the next two hours go by. Let's give her a hug. Uh, let's uh, and these about guitar solos because we like we like music. Let's discuss the latest games again. Uh, impersonate a celebrity. Um, we'll give all this a shot. Julia's back home from school. No need to make room on the refrigerator because her her uh, <laughs> grades are satisfactory. A little bit below satisfactory. Oh my god, they are just having fun. Debate gaming strategy. That sounds like something that could cause fights, but I, I don't know. I think they're 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 becoming pretty good friends. Uh, we're gonna definitely have Cassandra hang out here all day and try to make friends as much as she possibly can. This would be awesome if we could have a good girls' day out here and just and just make the best of it. I just I just want to make the best of it. Okay, this do they look happy? They they look happy. This is my brother's wife here and my wife, and they look like they're they're the happy they're the happy kind of people. That's that's what they look like. Okay, so let's see. Um, hmm. let's uh, share creative ideas again, cause hey, she's creative, like I said. Do an impression, bright day. No, no, no. Slap silly. No. Let's <laughs> let's like, avoid hitting her. <laughs> um, discuss logic puzzles. Come on, friends. Come on, friendship. Come on, friendliness. Come on, be fr asked to move in. No, no, no. <laughs> and I say no, no, no. Presley is fine, so she's not having anything too crazy going on right now. Let's give her another hug, and will this seal the deal with friendship? Oh, it did. It did. That And that day, she made up. No, it did not. <laughs> that day, she almost made a friend. Um, let's um, hmm, ask about her day again. How was your day? Uh, good. How was your day now? No, oh, It's okay now that I'm talking to you. Uh, share creative ideas. And let's go to funny. Since she is an entertainer, I feel like she can do these knock-knock jokes. At least pull something out of her. Whoa, it looks like it's getting spicy. A spicy girl's day. She just looks like, oh, you didn't. You just did not. You did. Oh, wow. Oh, no. This doesn't look good, guys. This looks only bad. This only leads to bad things. I don't like it. Are they offended? Are they, were they joking? Okay, okay. I was gonna say, oh Jesus. Uh, are they friends? Are they friends? Is this a friend thing? Are they friends? I can't tell. I want to hover over this. I want to see if they're friends. That looks like acquaintances to me. Uh, Presley, Presley, Presley. Friends. Okay, Presley and her are friends. She has four friends. We're gonna stop talking to Presley. We're gonna have Cassandra go home for the day. She made a friend. That's all we could ask. I, am I still asleep? Okay, I'm awake. I was gonna say, if I'm still asleep, I am useless. I am totally useless. We're going to have to go to bed early tonight. Even though we're not going to be tired, we're going to have to do it because I am not going to sleep until 2 o'clock every day. That's just depressing. Okay. So right when we get home, we're going to change Julia's outfit, plan her outfits, you know, change her hair, change all that. We'll get that all good and square. Um, and then we are going to make sure I write some books because we need to make some monies. Otherwise, we'll go broke. Our bills are 3500 bucks at a time. Uh, Julia, actually, we'll have Marshall make sure he does his homework. Even though his grades are so good. Um, he probably really doesn't even need to do it anymore, but let's just breeze through the homework really quickly. Uh, let's check her skills. What were they at again? Okay, so she needs a creative skill, and then social should be the next easiest one, or she can use a computer for motor skills, which I'm pretty sure she's practicing right now. But let's have, uh, myself come over here. We are gonna go here, and we are gonna write, uh, let's scrapbook. No, no, no. Let's resume writing clowning around. Oh, I forgot we were writing that. Oh, we're in need of social skill, you guys. We're in need some socialization. We are getting so lonely and sat and depressed. Uh, I'm, I'm playing on my kid's computer. Okay, so let's plan outfits. We got to change Julia's outfits. You guys said the hat's got to go. The shoes got to go. The everything's got to go. And we're going to make it go right now. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Master Style Aviator in the house. Okay, so remove that. Oh, this is better. <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay, so uh, that's her natural face. Uh, let's go with hair. So you guys said make... um. Julia looked like Cassandra as much as I can, so I guess I'll give it a shot. Um, I almost want her to be her own unique person. I know she's our daughter, but, you know, people have unique tastes and unique styles and unique things, so why not make people unique? Unique. I'm saying unique weird. Unique. Okay, so this one's the most Cassandra looking. Uh, she's definitely getting a little pudgy. You guys, you guys mentioned that. I'm going to give her a cross of my hair and Cassandra's, like a brownish, blackish. Because my hair's brown, her hair's, you know, black. So, uh, we'll go with brown and black. Uh, makeup. Uh, I can't put makeup on a kid, so I guess we'll, we won't do that. Let's go to outfits. Don't like the outfit. Hate the shoes. The shoes got to go. Okay, so let's see. Hmm. Are there any good outfits that are predetermined? 
eh, I don't know. This is like, I'm a girly girl and I do girly girl things. She she is a girly girl. Don't get me wrong. I don't want to. I don't want you guys to get me wrong, but I just don't want her to be classified as a girly girl. Let's see. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, she she it looks like she is putting on a little bit of weight. Uh, we're gonna have to have her play in the playground just a little bit more because we don't want her to get uh, overly pudgy. So let's see. Hmm. Those those are in. Eh, no no no. Those are not. Those are oh cool, god. These are. I, I am not the best at doing this. Uh, <laughs> oh god, I'm horrible. We gotta change the shirt now because that just doesn't go. This doesn't go. Oh there, that's not bad. Hey, yeah, I did something. I did something right, guys. I did it. Does that look? That looks. That looks better. Okay, here we go. Now we're really moving. Uh, we don't need the socks. We could put this little bracelet on her and make it pink. See there, she looks happier already. Now shoes. Uh, girls, uh, I like wearing sandals, so we'll give we'll give uh, Julia some sandals. Maybe some. No, she's wearing she's wearing uh, pants. Maybe she should wear shoes. Make it a little bit more normal. Oh God, those are like my grandma's shoes. Oh jeez, Julia, you don't. <laughs> oh God, please, someone save me. Someone save me from me. Okay, so that's horrible. I'm just gonna say. I'm just gonna put it out there. This is the worst. I'm the worst. Okay, so there you go. She looks okay. <laughs> She's in person. Uh, let's go to formal. We're going to just select a um, an actual formal dress. Let's go to, I don't know. This one looks cool. Oh, God, no. That's that's actually the opposite. Okay, so a pink. That's a nice pink dress. Now we can go to shoes and we can make them pink. There. She is a princess. <laughs> okay. Now athletic. Her athletic is... Uh, you know, okay, I guess. Um, we could probably. Oh God, what? Whoa, 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 whoa! Let's go like right like that, and then we need a shirt. I think I'm just gonna give her like some type of tank top or whatever this is. There we go. And then the shoes, the color just has to be changed to like a pink, because then everything will match. Yay! <laughs> now sleepwear. We don't need a uh, hashtag sleep for shoes. We need. We need, eh, let's go with, like, these bottoms. She's very pink. She likes being pink, I guess. She shops at Victoria's. Uh, let's see. Don't, th I don't think there's any pink here. There might be pink in this one. There is pink in this one. That's the same shirt she wears to work out, though. So that's, that's not good. Let's put the, oh, that's not, eh, okay. Let's, let's see. That is horrible. This is all bad. I'm the worst. I just made my daughter look so weird. Okay, eh, that's not bad. Yay, we did something. Okay, now partying. That is something you don't wear to a party. Okay, let's try this. Uh, we could we could give her like this. She looks like a balloon. Uh, okay, so go to sandals and let's make them pink. Um, pink. I don't know if there's a pink color. Is this it? That that's the beige, beige purple. I don't know. This I'm horrible at this. Uh, black with pink. Okay, that that uh, that is not that's not good. Okay, I'm just gonna do this. Okay, I don't question me, don't question my motives. Okay, and away we go. So there. So Julia is complete. She still is a child. You gotta remember, she's got a mold into her personality and into her body because she needs to work out, obviously. But you know, we're gonna we're gonna let her just mold and mold herself. Uh, that sounds fun. Okay. So now that we're done with that, Julia can focus on getting her homework done. Uh, she has a whole new look to her. Let's have her change her outfits. We want her to wear her everyday outfit and then do some homework. And she is going to have to play the violin like mad tonight. Now, where did she put that? Yeah, she left it in this little dining room. That's right. So after she's done doing her homework, she's going to practice the violin, which I think gives her a little bit of fun. Not a lot, but a little bit. Am I still on my son's computer? I am. What am I doing? What am I doing with my... Oh, tch. Because Cassandra's on my computer. Get off my computer. Get 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 off there. I'm supposed to be playing. I'm supposed to be writing books and stuff. Uh, let's resume writing clowning around. Now, Cassandra, you have to get off the computer and leave the computer area, please. Okay, so I'm standing here. Okay, I never knew it was this hard to get on the computer. I never... I, oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay, so let's go here. I want to write here. I want to write in my office. This is where I'm supposed to be writing. Nowhere else. Okay, so write, resume writing, clowning around. Now, Cassandra, please don't go on my computer. Cassandra, go all the way over here. All the way over here. Why can't I get off that computer? I Okay, now you come over here. Come over here. Come over here. Get out of that bedroom. Okay, I am so depressed, I can't even think that's what's wrong. Okay, so let's go to write, resume writing, clowning around. 
Okay, get over here. Hurry before Cassandra gets in here and tries to steal your computer. There we go. So what we're going to have um, myself do tonight is maybe a little bedroom time with Cassandra, and that will get our social right up there. Let's check in on Marshall. Oh, God. Sorry you have to listen to this, Marshall. This is probably not the most pleasant thing. This is definitely not the most pleasant. But Julia does look a lot better. Not going to lie. She looks a lot better. <laughs> Marshall should get the hairstyle that I have, though. That would be cool. But now I don't want them to be identical to us. I don't want them to be identical. So they, they have their own flair. They're their own person. So we don't want them to be just like cookie cutter. Like cut out here, cut out there, cut out there. Save people. Boop, 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 boop. I don't want that. No one wants that. Okay, so Marshall, once you're done eating, I think what you can do is come on the computer. And I want you to come and let's let's have him practice some typing. Why not? Let's let's get his typing skill up. Now let's check in on Cassandra. What is she up to? Uh, looks like she's sleeping. She's taking a nap. Okay, well, that's not something she needs to do. That sounds pretty useless, actually. Let's serve some dinner. Cassandra, we'll have you make... Uh, let's make some fish tacos. Let's make a big serving of fish tacos. You can eat some. You can put some away in the kid's lunchbox. Uh, let's check in on Julia. Did she get those skills? She did. Okay, so now all she has to focus on is... I guess, technically, she could do... Hmm. She could do mental. Or, like, motor skills. Uh, or she could do mental. So let's, let's have her do mental... Over here on the chemistry lab set. Uh, she definitely needs to work out, but that's not something we're going to focus too much on right now. Oh, God. Go use the toilet before you pee your pants. Let's let's have her stop. Okay, she acquired the mental skill, though. Uh, what time is it? Oh, God. It's already 10 o'clock at night. Go to sleep. Um, let's have Marshall go to sleep. Now, in the morning, Marshall, you will use the toilet. Go over here, Marshall. You will use the toilet in the morning. And then you will take a brisk shower, and that's how you're going to start off your day. Let's check in on me. Ooh, I'm almost done with the book. I am now a level 7 writing skill. So hopefully clowning around is a good success. I know our first book, our first comedy book, was actually a pretty big success. Uh, don't go to sleep. We want you to come over here, tell a joke about penguins, uh, take a picture, or no, no, profess on dying love, um, flatter, heartfelt compliment. We can do all those. So come out this way, Cassandra. You can somewhat talk to me as I'm typing. So that way I kind of get my happiness up. Deep conversation. Oh, I wrote, I wrote the book. I finished it. Awesome. Okay, so now we're going to have... Oh, it's full right now. Okay, woohoo. There we go. And that should get our social all the way up. We won't be depressed and all sad. And we'll actually get to bed at a decent hour. We're still learning traits about Cassandra. Oh, that's funny. Okay, so woohoo. Here we come. And there we go. That is romantic. And our social is skyrocketing. That's what we needed. Because we were feeling all sorts of depressed. So it's nice that we can be happy again. Now, I think in the morning, we'll have Julia eat first. Oh, we almost forgot the fish tacos. Put those away. Um, grab this. So she can eat. And that one's dirty. We'll have her eat spaghetti. Um, and we'll have Marshall open this. And let's have him eat some spaghetti, too. I think what I'm going to do is go right to sleep. Even though my guy's not tired yet, we're going to go to sleep. Here's our book, though. Clowning around. Let's just kick off our shoes and clown around. Sounds like a good book. We could read it. We could rename it. Uh, no, we're going to sell it. We're going to sell it, though. We're not going to read it. We don't want to read our own work, just in case it's bad. We don't want to feel guilty about putting a piece of crap out there. <laughs> okay. So, in the morning, we're going to eat. We're going to take a shower, because we're a little dirty. Let's check in on Cassandra, see what she needs. She's got to go to the bathroom, if anything. Yep, go to the bathroom, then come back and go to sleep. Okay. Good job. Is Marshall up for the day? Already 5 a.m. and up and ready to go at it today. That is awesome, Marshall. You, you keep it up, my friend. Okay, so once he's done eating, we're going to have him watch a little bit of kids' television. And I think Julia will do that, too, when she's done eating. So let's have her... Oh, I just exited... No, I didn't. Okay, good. I was going to say... Crap. Okay, so is she going to... Oh, wait. Did, did we run out of spaghetti? <gasps> did we run out of... No, we didn't. Okay, go ahead. Go go grab your spaghetti. I know. I know. I got in your way. I'm sorry. Okay, now go watch TV as you eat the spaghetti. Okay, go watch... Um, Yeah, Kids Network, because you need a little bit of fun. Now, uh, you should continue to watch it so you can talk with your sister. Marshall, you have to talk with your sister. So go over here. Watch current channel. Good job. Okay, so let's check in on me. I got to sell the book, so let's go to the mailbox. And we are going to sell to a publisher. We'll make more money clowning around. Okay, school is about to start for Marshall in about an hour. Julia's got or er, school in an hour. She's reached level 2 social, finally. She could tomorrow, technically, if we work hard enough on her social tonight. She could technically get her, her little grades up there to a B. Uh, Marshall is off to school. Julia, you have to go off to school. Have you left yet? Did you leave? Yes, you left. Okay, good. Okay, so Julia's off to school. 
I'm pretty much as happy as I can be right now. I think I'm going to start writing another book. Let's select a genre here. A workout guide. That sounds awesome. Let's write a workout guide. That sounds like a lot of fun. Okay, so let's call this, uh, let's call this, tw uh, no, let's do, let's call it four steps. Uh, four steps. Well, my hand's on the wrong keys. Four steps to being less fat. Now, this is a very, this is a very good book. Uh, we're, how are we going to describe it? How to be less fat. <laughs> okay, so there we go. We're going to write four steps to being less fat. Cassandra, she should call and see if her mom's willing to come over today. Now, I know her mom is a secret agent and works all of that. It was kind of weird hours and stuff. We're going to see if Bella's willing to come over. Oh, God, why are you always busy, Bella? Why are you always busy? Okay, let's have a <laughs> let's have her eat some of her fish tacos she made last night. Is there anything to clean up? Uh, okay, there is. Let's have her clean up the drink and clean up this dish and and do all of that good stuff. Oh, what is this? It's test day and Marshall is so nervous he totally blanks. Even copying his neighbor won't work because his neighbor is a D student. What do oh what to do? Uh, fiend illness or just take deep breaths? Take deep breaths. Let's see. Okay, he did it. He did it. You have to take every test seriously, so he did it. He did it. He's the best. Marshall's good. Love calculator paid out $7. Our games are paying out literally nothing. Those are not worth doing anymore. Our books are paying out pretty good. Horsing around, night of love, clowning around me, $347 a day. I'm pretty happy about that. Horsing around was our first book we did about a week ago, and it's still making $350. About a week ago, a week ago. Okay, so let's see. So Cassandra... Who can we invite over that you could possibly be a little bit better friends with? I don't know. Let's try Allison again. Even though she ran away from you that one time. That was only one time, though. Maybe she won't run away this time. Why are you always in your underwear and bra, Cassandra? Change outfit to uh, everyday one. Okay, so there. At least she's dressed normal now. Let's uh, replace the sink. Allison is too busy to hang out right now because she's got more important people to talk to. Okay. <laughs> that didn't say that. Oh, what is this? Oh, a dead person. Is this a dead person? It is a dead person. There's a dead person, guys. There's a dead person. Nancy. Oh, she got old. She got old. There's some old people, you guys. Oh, my God. But uh, you guys, I actually think this is a really good place to end the episode. Uh, it looks like um, Cassandra made another friend in this episode, which is great, Presley. And it looks like I wrote a couple of great books. Julia's got a makeover. And Marshall, of course, is doing great in school. But you guys, until next time. Oh, wait. Well, we forgot to do a secret comment. Okay, if you watch the whole episode... Comment down below, friends forever, because then people will be confused. I don't know what people people think differently. Okay, until next time, you guys. Friends, take it easy. Leave it squeezy.